Hello guys, this is Rupesh and I'm watching CBB Nerds video series on C++ interview questions and this question is how to make a member function of one class as a friend of another class. So we got this print function here which is a member function of base2 class and we want to make this particular function friend of this class. And why we need that? Because we are trying to access this dot x which is private here in this function. So instead of making this full class as friend there, we can simply just create this particular function and make this function as friend here. Okay, so if you just want to make this whole class as friend here, just you have to write it like class, sorry, friend, keyword is there, and then class, and this class name, base2, that's it. And now, Every function of this class can access private data member of this class. Okay, because you have written this inside this base one. But here it's not the case. We want to make some particular function, a friend function of this class. You want to do that just because you are accessing this private here. Okay, so this, this particular call will fail because you're, you are accessing this private and you cannot do that because this particular function doesn't belong to this class. So let's see how to do that. So first of all, this doesn't work the way uh, normal function work. I mean, let's suppose if there is some function fun and this is the function and you want to make this function a friend of yours, then you can just simply write friend void fun and that's it. Now this function will be able to access all the private stuff here but this is not the case with this one let's try that uh, i can show you and we have this in base 2 name is print and it is taking base 1 as reference okay this should work correct but it won't work let's check that see there are three sorry three errors and one of the error is saying that at line number 10 here, uh, this one, it is telling, I don't know what is this base 2, what you're talking about. Because your compiler system will start from top and it will encounter this base 2 and it will say, hey, I don't know what is this base 2. And you're saying that there is some print function inside base 2, so I don't know what is base 2, so I don't know what is this function. And this is the root cause of all the errors. So, in order to solve this problem, what we can do is you can copy this full class and paste it here. Okay, so before this encounters, you know what is base2 and print inside that. But wait a minute, few people might say that I should use a forward declaration. So let me show you that it won't work. Forward declaration means you should forward declared this one here. So we can do something like base Two. But this is not going to work either. Let's check that. See, there are two errors now and it is saying that b2 name nested specifier, whatever it is, is not complete. It is incomplete. Okay. This b2 is incomplete and you are saying that I have something called print inside b2 and I'm not aware of that because you don't have provided me any information. So we cannot do this. So let's remove this so yeah I was talking about we have to take this up so let's do that okay but we haven't solved the problem yet why I can tell you if I will compile that now <laughs> it will tell you now I don't know what is b1 here <laughs> you're trying to access this b1 and it will start compiling from top and it will see that okay you're accessing b1 dot x what is this x I'm not sure so you cannot place this one down, you cannot place this one up. No, 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 that is not the case here. We have the solution. The solution is you declare this function here and define after this class. I will show you what I mean. Let's copy this, paste it here. Okay, let's do some indentation. And this print function belongs to base two. So this is cool now. 
and yeah you just give the declaration part don't give the definition here it was creating the problem because you was going to access this dot x now you are not accessing anything here and it is fine so let's try now and compile this okay what is this oh yes and one more thing you have to forward declare this so let's do that class this one okay and here we can easily forward declare this because we are not accessing anything inside this class we have just declared that we will be using this b1 data type and we are actually using here but before that we have defined what is b1 so this is the whole game and let's compile and check that see you got x is equal to 10 so now it is working and this is some warning here private field yeah we have not used this y inside this one we are just printing this x so that's what is showing that you have not used it so it's just a warning okay i should disable this it's pretty annoying when you are teaching something right so i hope you would have understood this we have this class b1 is the object what you are trying to do is you are passing this b1 here and trying to access this b1's private stuff inside some another function which doesn't belong to that b1 class so you wanted to make that particular function as friend but that function is not a global function so you have to declare it first then you can say that that function is my friend but this is not the general case with the normal functions right uh, i can show you with another example void fun uh, fun can take this base one ref function we can create this function fun base one ref b let's give some message fun okay and if you will call this fun and pass b1 and let's see if it is working or not see it is working fun is printing 10 you created this function after saying that some function would be my friend because this is a global function okay but in this case the problem was you were saying that some function is my friend but that function is inside this type and compiler didn't know what is this type so this is a problem and this is the solution for this i think you would have understood this if you have any doubt please comment and let's summarize this video thanks for watching bye bye and yeah if you like the video don't forget to hit the like button dude Oh, 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 oh,